Hi friends, this is Fire on Pop, and uh, this video this is a short video um, about 22 rimfire. Now, as you can see here by the by the photos, uh, I own the NAA mini revolver. I own a P22. Uh, uh, I own the Buckmark, um, and that's the P22 again. And I own the NAA uh, 22 rimfire. Now, th these rimfire pistols are great. I enjoy having them and uh, usually uh, try to shoot them as often as I can. However, the reason for this video is the last... Uh, I'm looking at a lot of other YouTubers' videos. And I'm looking at magazines. And uh, here you're going to see uh, Guns and Ammo. And uh, the big, uh, on the front cover is Ruger's Rockin' Rimfires, uh, 22s for 2012. Now, I also have watched many, many uh, uh, YouTube videos on uh, on the SHOT Show that just happened, the 2012 SHOT Show. And uh, many, many uh, 22 Rimfires were featured. And... Uh, and you know, and just this uh, article goes on, and it shows you when you get to the set here, we're all rim fired up, and uh, it's featuring the Ruger's uh, revolver and uh, semi-auto in 22 rim fire. So my question to you, my friends, is this: Is uh, 22 rim fire is that the uh, the new standard? Uh, why are people buying them? Why is it such a hot weapon? Um, I'd love to hear your comments. Is it uh, just a cheap target practice? Is it uh, a new concealed carry weapon? Is it uh, just a new fad? And uh, it'll all go away. And I'd love to hear your opinion. So please, in the comment section below, let's, uh, let's all participate and tell me what you think about this new trend towards 22 rimfires. And as always, this is Fire on Pop. Be safe out there, and God bless. Bye now.